Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to, welcome to an episode of The non cooperators where I'm playing Metal Gear Outer Heaven. Fan-made game on the Android, iOS, and everything. Uh, this is uh, the second episode, I think, so I think this, is probably, this probably might be our last episode uh, for this game, because uh, this game is not really that long, unfortunately. Because it's got potential! It really does. Like, I know you don't see it, but it's an Android game. Do you ever see like any Android game with a lot of a lot of potential? I mean, but whatever. Like I said, he's wearing the uh, big boss uh, outfit from Metal Gear Solid Three. He's supposed to be wearing like this all green. No bandana, by the way. No bandana. Oh, he doesn't get the bandana till oh shit. Uh, the second one, right? Metal Gear Metal Gear Two Solid Snake. I think I don't remember honestly. Oh, let me take care of this guy first. Beware. The floor is electrified. Touching it will shock you. There should be a button somewhere to turn it off. Find it and flip the switch. I'm sorry, I cut you off there. What? Ugh. There was supposed to be an actual. There were supposed to be so many remakes uh, to the original Metal Gear Solid game, and honestly, there's, there, there's. I think there's still speculations on it. Like, I don't know what the hell is going on with it. It's, it's just tossed up in the air, being like, Yeah, let's just do whatever we want with it at this point. They, oh, whoa. 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 Should I box it? I'm gonna box it. Let me, uh... That's not... Okay. Uh, shit. How do you box? There we go. Can I... Wait, can I, uh, get out of here, though? Oh, I can. Oh, shit. Okay. Try to big boss this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Card number three must be somewhere in this area. How do you know? Oh, that's right, because you're the leader of this terrorist activity. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh shit! Damn it! Oh. It's interesting. Oh. This game is definitely very interesting when it comes to uh, this type of style. Not this card number three. Yeah, okay, whatever. Uh, the mechanics when it comes to the cards, because it doesn't actually do the same thing that it used to do in Metal Gear Solid. I'm sorry, Metal Gear, where you had to equip the card and then go through the door in the original Metal Gear games. Oh. It's basically just doing the mechanics from Metal Gear Solid 2. It's, it's following the same mechanics as Metal Gear Solid 2. You have the, 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 the card key in your inventory and you basically just walk right through the door no matter what. Can I open any of these and like start being a snake beater? Any? No? There's, there's no action buttons. Just punch, shoot, and move around. And equip items, that's all. There's not an action button. Um, shit, 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 shit. So let me, uh, let me, uh, What the fuck?! No! Oh. Bang, bang! Oh. That was so not my fault. I'm gonna hide in... Where the hell am I? Seriously, wait, what the hell? It's like a weird transition when it comes to these uh, this level. And we're back to pure silence. But yeah, uh, big spoiler alert if you guys have not played any of the Metal Gear Solid games. This big boss is not the real big boss. He's not the he's not our bio. Oh, we're in the showers. He's not our biological father. He is um, the guy you play as in Metal Gear Solid Five: The Phantom. Well, again, spoiler alert. So the guy you play as a Metal Gear Solid Five. Oh fuck! I didn't even see the camera. What? This box with the flashing light must be the switch that turns off the juice. It can be deactivated with a punch or a shot. Well, being that we're having a lot of people coming by, I'm just gonna shoot the fucker. Okay. I actually like the uh, uh, the alert uh, uh, noise from Metal Gear Solid. Uh, I want to say no, not Twin Snakes. Uh, the the first, well, you know, the first one, Metal Gear Solid. Well, yeah, I'm just gonna refer to it as the Twin Snakes, but whatever. Um, I like that uh, that alert uh, noise, uh, alert music, much better than 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 any of the uh, than, than the second one and everything. And I completely forgot what my train of thought. You know, what? I want to I want to use the pistol. Oh, this whoops. box with the flashing light must be the switch that turns off the juice. I want to use my SOCOM. I like my so I like the SOCOM. Okay. Like I said, it's very difficult for me to like transition back and forth. What? Snake, it's down. Gray Fox should be at the end of his car. No shit! It's down. I'm clearly walking on the fucking little gravel piece of shit of 
Whatever the fuck this is. I'm surprised I didn't have to use the Nikita missile and everything like that. Alright, so we are going... Oh, hello. I've been waiting for you, Snake. I'm what? sure you must have heard of me. What? I'm Shoot Gunner. Are you sure? No one ever escapes my heart. He looks like a pirate. Your friend is behind this door. Maybe he's alive, or maybe I beat him to death. Either way, you gotta get past me. Okay. I'll do it with the SOCOM. So, um... <laughs> Look oh. at your uniform, Snake. What? There's a shoot gunner. A former member of Foxhound, who defected earlier this year and joined force with MSF. He's a two-bit mercenary and psychopath. Snake, you must defeat him and rescue Grey Fox. I don't remember him in Metal Gear Solid <laughs> 5. Look at your uniform. I think Look. 1972 wants Look. him back. Look at yours. Powder and that only uses elite technology. And do you know why you look like a damn pirate? Feed? Because Foxhound funds are being deferred, deferred directly to the government of Outer Heaven. There. Is that all you got, son? I son? said your best shot, punk. Damn it! I'm like ten men coming to you at once. Okay, you got some skills. I'm not even fighting him. He's he's running on the goddamn electric floor, killing himself. <laughs> Look at your uniform. I think 1972 wants it back. And that's Outer a reference to uses elite technology. Metal Gear Solid. And do you know where you're left with the chicken feet? Or or um Peace Walker. I because think. Fox Hound funds are being deferred, deferred directly to the government of Outer Heaven. Is that all you got, son? All right, son? hang on. There. Now he's the your best shot, punk. I'm like Come on, you pirates! To you at once. Come on, Captain Hook. Okay, you got some skills. He's dead. You Come on, Captain Hook! Defeat me, Snake. But the ideals of Outer Heaven will live beyond me. Ah. <laughs> Epic death. <clears throat> Alright, so now we're gonna. Oh shit, sorry. The fucking mouse always. Great Fox! Oh wow, that actually even looks like Great Fox from Metal Gear Solid uh, 2. Great Fox. To be continued, thanks for playing. Woo! Alright, unfortunately, I don't know if The conflict has reached a critical point due to the threat of a possible nuclear attack. The rebel army has partnered themselves with a well-turned company of mercenaries okay. I don't know. known as MSF. Ah, uh, whatever. Currently, um, MSF are at the base north of Galberg, out, I guess, but, um, known as Outer Heaven. You know what? Just, From just, there, exit, exit, just, exit, just There we go. There we go. So, um... This was a fan-made game. Uh, it was actually really fun, honestly, just to play it on your Android. I'm gonna do the VR training just, just, just to kill time. It's like we're like eight minutes in this episode, I think. But um, it is a little bit unfortunate because I, when I was trying to like uh, uh, find uh, the second part of it, uh, it doesn't exist, or like it did exist and you can't get it anymore, or some shit like that. Uh, if you guys can find it, yeah, absolutely. Can you guys help me out and get? Holy shit, that is not. Oh, okay. Uh, 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 restart. Oh, there we go. Oh, what? Oh, damn it. I was gonna say, how did you not see me? So I don't even know what tonight we get to do in this in this level. Oh! At least I'm exploring as much as I can in this game, so for your viewers' sake. But um, yeah, I was looking for a second part to this, and there doesn't exist. God damn it! Oh. Or like, I can't find it. If you guys can find it, uh, absolutely. Can you guys like help me out and like uh, show me where to get it? Like, and 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 also tell me that if it works or not, because I keep finding it, but it doesn't work. Same thing with there's a there's a part three as well because I would love to continue with this because um, I'm gonna be perfectly honest with you I never actually beat Metal Gear Solid uh, Metal Gear the very first one from beginning to end I did beat the Nintendo the Nintendo port the original Nintendo one I never beat the MSX version and this is supposed to be based on the MSX version. Oh, hang on. Alright, I can't move! Can't see! Come on! It's like a survival, honestly. As long as I got rations equipped, we're good! Okay, we're good. 
So I say, as long as I got rations, we're, 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 all good, we're good to go. There you go, four rations now. With 227 uh, Famas ammunition, not to mention our SOCOM pistol. Does anybody have any props from Metal Gear Solid? I'm only curious, like, um, because I got so much, like, uh, like merchandise, I meant merchandise. Um, I got so much Metal Gear Solid merchandise because I'm such a major fucking fan of, of Metal Gear Solid. It's like my, my favorite uh, video game franchise. Um, what do I have? I got the, uh, actually, a lot of people are jealous that I have this. That I actually have, I got the, uh, oh, what the hell? You didn't... I got the, uh, the full-scale bionic arm from Metal Gear Solid 5. Is that it? I mean, like, is that it in this level? Because I don't see anything else. Like, there's, there's nothing. There's nothing. Like, there's no, like, exit point. There's no, like... Do I kill them all? Do I take out the cab? I don't even know. What am I supposed to be doing here? I think this is, like, basically just a beta test of, like, hey, just run around in this VR-looking thing. I mean, it's cool and everything, but it's just like, well, now what? A little upsetting. But, honestly, this was, uh, look, this was really fun to play. I definitely enjoyed myself. Uh, I really wish I could actually even uh, be able to finish it, but I can't. There's three, there's a total of three parts. Part one works. Uh, part two can't find, like, a working one. And same thing with part three, can't find a working one. If you guys can find it, like, I'll link, um, if you guys want to play this game, I'll link it down in the description in the first video and the second video. And, um, if you guys can find uh, part two and part three and a functioning one that works, please let me know because I will absolutely play the shit out of them. And also, one last thing um, for Metal Gear Solid, because like I said, I found this game by accident because I was looking for Metal Gear Solid, uh, the uh, Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid Mobile. I was looking for the one, the, the actual canon continuation from Metal Gear Solid to Metal Gear Solid Two. It would take place in between, and I was one, I was one to play it. Never had a chance to play it. It's on the Neo, uh, the the Engage or Neo Geo, whatever it is, and. Uh, there's no emulators for it, there's nothing for it, but if you guys can find it on the computer or of any way that I can play it on here for the show, because I would absolutely play it for the show and for my personal use. In the meantime, like, comment, subscribe, let me know uh, what you think, let me know uh, what other uh, games you want me to play, whether it's Metal Gear related or not Metal Gear related, uh, and obviously, uh, co-op games, because that's our show, we're just the cooperators, and this has not been a non-cooperator episode, and we'll see you next time.